earlier this year, Biology Letters published an article listing all the peer reviewers who refereed for the journal in 2016. Today, we thank one of our top reviewers, Professor Moya Meredith-Smith, and present her with a certificate marking her contribution to the journal. Thank you very much. And since she's here, we'll ask for her thoughts on the peer review process in general. So, sure. Moya, yes. <laughs> uh, thank you for joining us today. Um, That's a pleasure. What does peer review mean to you? Why is it important to you? Well, I think we're obliged to do them in our subject area and it's very essential that the paper is reviewed strictly and fairly mm -hmm. and then you can get a paper which is good and accurate and truthful. Mm -hmm. And given your busy schedule you must be asked to peer review many papers from many journals. Yes, um, it's hard to say no mm -hmm. sometimes but you have to be realistic and it does take a long time, mm -hmm. especially if you're going to be fair, be critical and be careful not to be too aggressive in what you said. What tips would you give to other peer reviewers when it comes to them reviewing for other journals and other papers? Is there anything that they should be aware of or they should keep in mind when they're providing comments back to authors? Um, no, just to be fair and um, try to avoid being prejudiced, but that's difficult because it's very close to your own subject, so you wonder why they are writing what they're writing sometimes. But I think you should feed back to them what, obviously, a lot of critical comments, if there are critical comments to be made. So, you know, you have to do that. And I like to think that the paper is much improved because they respond to your comments. So I usually say, tick the box that says, would you see it again after it's been presented? And I usually say yes, because I want to see how they've answered the comments. Okay. So I think that makes the paper much better. Does that help with your own research? Oh yes, of course. I know what my competitors are doing, okay. <laughs> if I'm honest, of course. <laughs> yes. Uh, sometimes it's good to put your name on the paper as a reviewer. Sometimes I don't always want to do that. Mm -hmm. And uh, they quite often they guess anyway who you oh, are. Oh, really? Yes. Okay. So, you know, you can never be sure to be anonymous <laughs> if you want to be. <laughs> but um, that's my own personal view. And. When it comes to incentivising peer reviewers, because ah, yes. asking peer reviewers to give up their most precious commodity, their time, is a big ask, um, what incentives would you appreciate receiving as a peer reviewer? Well, exactly. I mean, this is it. I mean, okay, you get to know intimately what somebody else is writing about, which is your subject, which you might want to write about also, so that's good. but. I think you do want recognition. I think it, there hasn't been any recognition of how much time people put into reviewing. Okay. It would be nice to say, on a piece of paper, okay, like that, 